muffled heart sounds, jugular venous distension, and hypotension is a triad of cardiac tamponade. It is Beck's triad. A short PR interval, delta waves, and a wide QRS complex is a triad of Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome. Extremity claudication, Raynaud's phenomenon, and migratory superficial vein thrombophlebitis is thromboangiitis obliterans, also called Berger's disease. Recurrent oral ulcers, genital ulcers, and eye inflammation is for Bechet's disease. Palpable purpura, abdominal pain, and arthritis is for Hinoch Schönlein purpura. Dermatitis, dementia, and diarrhea is for Pellagra. Acral dermatitis, alopecia, and diarrhea is for acrodermatitis and teropathica, zinc deficiency. Acute onset of symmetric flaccid descending paralysis, afebrile and normal mental status is for botulism. Jaundice, colicky right upper quadrant abdominal pain, and fever with rigors is for acute cholangitis, Charcot's triad. Charcot's triad with hypotension and altered consciousness is for Reynolds' pentad of acute cholangitis. Central nervous system depression, respiratory depression, and meiosis is for Opioid poisoning, altered mental status, autonomic instability, and neuromuscular hyperactivity is for serotonin syndrome, hypothermia, coagulopathy, and acidosis is for hemorrhagic shock, the lethal triad of trauma, bradycardia, Hypotension and hypothermia is for neurogenic shock. Cirrhosis, diabetes, and bronze-colored skin is for hemochromatosis. Small firm testes, azoospermia, and gynecomastia is for Klinefelter syndrome. Parathyroid pancreatic islet and pituitary tumors is for multiple endocrine neoplasia type 1, also called Wormer's syndrome. Episodic headache, diaphoresis, and palpitations is for pheochromocytoma. Symptoms of hypoglycemia, plasma glucose less than 50 mg per deciliter, and relief of symptoms with correction of glucose levels is for Whipple's triad of insulinoma. Painful bones, renal stones, abdominal groans, and psychic moans is for primary hyperparathyroidism. Smoking, spirits, spices, sharp teeth or spikes, Syphilis and sunlight are the six S's of cancer of the head, neck, and mouth. Recurrent attacks of vertigo, fluctuating sensoroneuronal hearing loss, and tinnitus is for Meniere's disease. Fragile bones, blue sclera, and early deafness is for osteogenesis imperfecta, asthma, aspirin sensitivity, and nasal polyposis is for aspirin-sensitive asthma, Samter's triad, gastric acid hypersecretion, 
severe peptic ulcer disease, and non-beta islet cell tumors of the pancreas is for Zollinger-Ellison syndrome. Multiple osteomas, colonic polyposis, and soft tissue fibromas is for Gardner's syndrome. Dysphagia to solids and liquids, regurgitation and weight loss is for achalasia. Dysphagia, glossitis, and iron deficiency anemia is for plumber vinson syndrome. Tumefaction, draining sinus tracts, and grain-filled or granular discharge is for Madura foot, fever, rash, and history of tick exposure is for Rocky Mountain Spotted Fever, an ulcer that is non-tender, non-purulent, and indurated is for primary syphilis, the chancre of primary syphilis, spiking fevers, anemia, and splenomegaly is for Malaria, protein urea, hypoalbuminemia, and generalized edema, specifically with an, a level of protein urea greater than 3 grams per day, is for nephrotic syndrome, and some authors say greater than 3.5 grams. Aphasia, apraxia, and agnosia is for Alzheimer's disease. Headache, fever, and focal neurologic deficit is for brain abscess. Saddle anesthesia, bowel or bladder dysfunction, and lower extremity weakness is for cauda equina syndrome. Nystagmus, intention tremor, and scanning speech is Charcot's triad of multiple sclerosis. So there's two totally different Charcot's triads. Tremor, psychological changes, and gingivitis is for chronic inorganic mercury intoxication. Hypertension, bradycardia, and abnormal breathing is for Cushing's triad of increased intracranial pressure, anterior neck pain, signs of ischemia or stroke, and Horner syndrome is for internal carotid artery dissection, gait disturbance, cognitive impairment, and urinary urgency or incontinence is for normal pressure hydrocephalus. Seizures, mental retardation, and facial adenofibromas is for tuberous sclerosis, ophthalmoplegia, ataxia, and confusion is for Wernicke's encephalopathy, altered mental status, hypertension, and papilledema is for hypertensive encephalopathy. Resting tremor, rigidity, and bradykinesia is for Parkinson's disease. Back pain or localized tenderness, fever, and progressive limb weakness is for spinal epidural abscess. Rapidly progressive dementia, myoclonus, and periodic electroencephalogram activity is for Kreutzfeldt Jakob disease. Atrophic weakness of the hands and forearms, slight spasticity of the arms and legs, and generalized hyperreflexia is for amyotrophic lateral sclerosis. Cranial nerve palsies, radiculopathy, and meningitis is for Lyme disease, the disseminated phase. Dysmenorrhea, dyspareunia, and dyschezia, or dysmenorrhea, dyspareunia, and infertility 
is for endometriosis, benign ovarian tumor, ascites, and pleural effusion is for Meig syndrome. During pregnancy, the triad of hypertension, proteinuria, and edema is for preeclampsia. Membrane rupture, painless vaginal bleeding, and fetal bradycardia is for vasoprevia. Amenorrhea, vaginal bleeding, and abdominal pain is for ectopic pregnancy. Profuse watery vaginal discharge, pelvic pain, and pelvic mass is for fallopian tube cancer. Let's go triad. Lower abdominal tenderness, cervical motion tenderness, and adnexal tenderness is for pelvic inflammatory disease. Loss of vision, eye pain, and dyschromatopsia is for optic neuritis. Elbow dislocation, Radial head fracture and coronoid fracture is for terrible triad of the elbow. Polyostotic fibrous dysplasia, precocious puberty, and cafe au lait skin pigmentation is for Albright syndrome or McCoon Albright syndrome. Sensory neuronal hearing loss, congenital heart disease, and cataract is for congenital rubella, chorioretinitis, hydrocephalus, and cerebral calcifications is for congenital toxoplasmosis, notched incisor teeth, interstitial keratitis, and sensory neuronal hearing loss is for Hutchinson's triad of congenital syphilis, situs inversus totalis, chronic sinusitis, and bronchiectasis is for Cartagener's syndrome, or amodal cilia syndrome, a short web neck with low hairline and reduced cervical range of motion is for Klippelfile syndrome. A child with ataxia, cranial neuropathies, and long tract signs is for a brainstem tumor. A child with the triad of poor language, poor social interaction, and restricted or repetitive behavior and interests is for autism. Disordered eating, amenorrhea, and osteoporosis or osteopenia in a female is for the female athlete triad. Loosening of associations, affective inappropriateness, autistic features, and ambivalence is called the four A's of schizophrenia. Impaired attention, increased impulsivity, and excessive motor activity is for attention deficit hyperactivity disorder. Right paratracheal adenopathy and bilateral hilar adenopathy is a triad of sarcoidosis. It's also called Garland's triad, pawnbroker sign, and the one, two, three sign of sarcoidosis. Digital clubbing Symmetric arthritis and long bone periostitis is a triad for hypertrophic osteoarthropathy. A grade 3 tear of the posterior horn of the medial meniscus, a tear of the medial collateral ligament of the knee, and anterior cruciate ligament is for O'Donoghue's unhappy triad, the classic big 3 injury to the knee. A gradually narrowing joint space, juxtaarticular osteoporosis and marginal erosions is for tuberculous arthritis, 
Femister's Triad. Plain film findings in a two to eight month year old, including absent or small proximal femoral capital epiphysis, lateral displacement of the femur, and a shallow acetabulum with an increased inclination of the acetabular roof is for developmental dysplasia of the hip, Putti's triad. Exophthalmos, diabetes insipidus, and large lytic skull lesions is for Hans-Schuller Christian disease. Neutropenia, splenomegaly, and nodular rheumatoid arthritis is for Felty's syndrome. Bilateral hilar lymphadenopathy, erythema nodosum, and polyarthritis is for Lufgren syndrome. Urethritis, conjunctivitis, and arthritis is for reactive arthritis. Xerostomia, xerophthalmia, and arthritis is for Sjogren syndrome.